91X loudspeaker, these white pigeons take me all apart. We have the guy that is basically these white pigeons, Jesse Dean Eisenbarth. How are you, sir? I'm doing great, Tim. How are you doing? I'm doing better than you. Yeah. I was not <laughs> in a drive-by. Thanks. Uh, you have a bullet in your hand at this moment still, right? Yes, I do. Uh, this happened less than a month ago? July 1st. Wow. Yeah. You're doing pretty good. Thank you. Uh, this is something that doesn't happen to many people. Uh, but it happened to you. Wow. Yeah. Maybe you should have bought a lottery ticket. A lottery right. ticket would have been a better uh, choice. Yeah, probably. definitely. Well, we're glad you're here. You're okay. And we're not uh, really focusing on why or what had happened or what's going on. But you're healing. Yeah. And you're doing all right. Two two weeks after, and I'm already playing guitar. Like, it hurts a little bit, but the more you do it, the better it, or easier it gets. So. That was my biggest concern, I think, is just the dexterity of your fingers. And, yeah, it's and, uh, amazing. I could imagine how, um, you know, that would be something that would sit pretty heavy on your heart, that you wouldn't be able to write songs. Absolutely, and the thought crossed my mind, but it was like the first thought I had after this happened was just my music and keep breathing. Yeah. Yeah, so. <laughs> and this was all reported on the news. Obviously, it was kind of a big deal. Uh, this happened over in the Spring Valley area. Spring right Valley, there. yeah. You were at a bad place, wrong place, wrong time. It's uh, coincidental. Seems like random, yeah. All right. Well, yeah. moving forward, as you heal, these white pigeons have an upcoming show, actually. What's yeah, happening? at the Bancroft in Spring Valley. It's a classic nice. spot for that. Yeah. First show to come back. In Spring Valley. Yeah. But that's a nice part of Spring Valley. Yeah, I love. I love. Nice I love the Bancroft. I've never played a show there, so it's going to be my first show there. Oh, very cool. Yeah. There's actually a benefit though coming up as well for you. Yeah, for, uh, Full Circle Saloon in Santee off Magnolia. And what, what? When is that? And what's going on? On the 13th. It's just uh, people come together and uh, got set up like a little GoFundMe thing that I kind of want to take down, but it's just awesome that people are coming together to bring me back on my feet and get me back into swinging and I'm just really blessed. Yes you are. Some guy took you to Warp Tour yesterday. Yeah, Tim Files took me to Warp Tour. Uh, yeah, it was awesome. <laughs> I lost you. I was working for San Diego and I texted you towards, you know, about 6.30 and I was a little concerned because my phone was dying. Your yeah. phone was dead. Yeah, dead. It died. Like, it's so, I need a battery pack or something. I just gapped that. But you made that. it home okay. Yeah, I did. Uh, I, I picked friends. you up yesterday yeah. as the nice guy that I am. Yeah. <laughs> got you tickets, and there was your lovely mother at the door waving oh. goodbye, and I said, I'll take good care of him. Yeah. And my first thought was this morning, like, oh, crap. Well, hey, thank you for I had, getting back to me. I had the biggest worry on my head, too. I was like, you know. The phones nowadays, it's like you can't even, especially with what happened, but with nowadays, it's just like you lose your phone for a minute and everything goes All nuts. All hell breaks. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what bands did you see yesterday at Warp Tour that you liked? Um, I saw, let's see, Microwave. They're a pop punk ish band that I've been following for a little bit. I saw Goldfinger for the first time. Nice. And that was amazing. That guy just keeps going and he's more energetic. Uh, John Feldman, he's more energetic than. A lot of the bands that are up there, and I'm just in awe by that. Sure. Like, um, and then I saw uh, Two Right Love in Her Arms is a suicide prevention um, tent, and they gave me a free hat, and I was just really, oh, cool. really stoked on that. That was probably my favorite part. Just like I got a free hat. I got that was a big thing. part of it. Of course, people yeah. spoke before some of the bands and just tried to. Yeah, like, like that realize. was a key thing. Is like there's multiple things going in and out of the stages, and oh yeah, and. Um, it was just a cool experience, and thanks a lot. For I'm glad you had a good time. Yeah. I saw War, TSOL, The Adolescents, a little bit of New Year's Day, a little bit of Goldfinger, um, uh, this band called The Twilight Creeps. The Twilight Creeps? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I, I heard about them. Stuff. I'm yeah. glad you had a good time and saw some yeah. good stuff, too. I wanted to be part of the healing process for you, give you something to look forward to, Yeah. and uh, I'm glad you had a good time, and more importantly, made it home safely. Yeah. By the way... You can get these songs right now, yes, These White Pigeons, by going to thesewhitepigeons.bandcamp.com. There is a, a rather uh, long album. How many tracks are there again? I think there's Fourteen. Like Fourteen tracks. I love one that there's, uh, the last song is called Pile of Poetry. Yeah, yes. I'm the piles of local music. Yes. Anyway.
nonetheless. Look forward to uh, supporting your band. You put this album out on my birthday. Thank you for that, man. No way. Yes, that's awesome. Be with yeah. you. Oh my gosh, that's All so right, cool. All right, so wait, These White Pigeons next show, when is it? Uh, wait. Bancroft when? Yeah, the 28th of August. Okay. Um, it's with Geneva Pina um, currently so far. Yeah. Cool. I'm glad you're back. I'm glad you're doing well and uh, just happy to help out and Thank you. And uh, put a smile on your face, Jesse Dean Eisenbarth. <laughs> I love that. I don't know why, you know, I have the hardest time with some bands remembering everybody's name, but you, you're, I got all three of your names yeah, down pat. Yeah, absolutely, from the moment we it's met. It's pretty cool. It's awesome. All right, well, thanks for being here. What would you like to say about The Wall, the next song we're going to play of yours? Um, it's just about being around other people and noticing the things that are on their shoulder and just, it's like a chip and getting over it and continue on continuing on that's about it keep it going brother yeah. thanks Just for being swimming. here jesse dean eisenbar these white pigeons formerly of color till monday color till monday yeah they're still a band too though right yeah they're on tour they're going up to the west coast and they're coming back pretty soon good for them thanks yeah. for being here buddy yeah thank you so much you're welcome this is well, jesse dean eisenbar also these white pigeons twp for short track is the wall it's loudspeaker Thank <laughs> you.